Hi, this is Deborah from Dinglefoot.com, and this week I'm going to show you how to make a Father's Day card using the tags from a proper gentleman. This is from Graphic 45, and there are three of these little car fronts on this sheet, so I punched out two already. And I'm going to use this third one also, and these just pop right out of the paper. So I'll use that. I also have a gray card and a piece of patterned paper that will also go on the front. And I have a little piece of cream paper. I'm going to mount these little car tags to it. And then I printed this on my computer. It says, Dad, you're a classic. And that's going to get mounted on red paper. I have a border punch that I'm going to use on the side of my decorative paper. And then I have three colors of glimmer mist. I have a gold and a red and a blue. I'll be using that along with a plain old stapler. So, it, oh, I forgot. I also have a little piece of black ribbon. We'll be using that too. And I think that's all I need. First of all, I'm going to take my patterned paper and I'm just going to punch the edge of it here. So I'll do that the whole way along. Okay, so my border is punched on my paper and that can just go, get glued right on the front of the card. It's going to go right here. And then I need to take this piece of paper here and this one and I'm going to glimmer mist it with all three of these colors. So just need a little space here. Of course you need to get your glimmer mist shaken up. Good. So we're just going to give just a little bit to each. Then I'm going to do the red. Your paper is going to curl up until it's dry. That's just, you might just have to hold it down if it's getting too curled up. Then I'm going to also do the gold color. This one's getting, try not to smear it. Okay, and then I'm going to go ahead and dry those with my heat tool. Okay, I got these all dried now. This one kind of, because the paper curled, I should have held it down. Got more red in the middle, but that's all right. We will make it work. I'm going to go ahead and just glue this to my piece of red paper. Just goes right on there. And then for this piece of paper, we're going to take our little tags that we popped out of the paper, and these are just going to get glued on here. And I'm going to put some spacing in between them. You can glue these first, or you can just simply take your stapler. What I'm going to do is put two here and then just staple staple these two on the side I'll try to stay in front of the camera so you can see but I'm going to put um, two staples here and then add my third tag and put two staples here but I think I will go ahead and just glue them a little bit so they're not moving around on me let's get them stuck where I want to Need a little space at the top because I'm going to put my ribbon these are going to go right like that. Okay, then I simply take my stapler, see if we can see where we're stapling here. I'm going to put a staple there, and one there, and then just turn my tag around. You can see there's two staples there. I turn the tag around and put two staples right here. And then I'm going to take my little piece of black ribbon, just fold the loop like that, 
and that's also going to get stapled right on the top of my tag here. So, let's see if I can hold it in place here. We'll just, oops. Staple that right on the top of our tag. There we go. Maybe add another one just to keep it in place. Okay, so that's our little tag, and that's going to go right on the front of our card right there. And then I'm going to put this on this side. So let's go ahead and get those on there. I took my little sentiment here, and I decided to also staple this just so it matches the tag part that I did. So I stapled in each corner. So all we do now is get some glue. We'll glue that up good. I had this glued on the front, and then I wanted staples on it, so I took it off. And did the staple part and now I can just simply pop that right back on the card where I had it and we are finished with this one I hope you try making this card it's fun and easy and thanks so much for watching